Hey everybody, I am going to show you today, actually, first of all, my name is Matthew, and I'm going to show you something that Jessica Powell showed me and a bunch of other people last week when we were down in Quero. I thought it was really cool, super clean, um, and it adds a certain fit and finish to your uh, Google slide presentation or any kind of presentation. Um, what we're going to do is we are going to show you how you can search for a transparent image, which means an image on a transparent background. So when you insert it into the slide, it just shows the image and not that wonky box, like white box usually around it. So first of all, let's do a search. We're going to do barbecue, BBQ. And we're going to go to images. Now this you probably have all seen, right? I go here and then here are all the images. Okay, so if we let's let's kind of do one of those. Um, first, we do it the way that we used to do it, which is I'm going to take the first one. That BBQ looks pretty darn good. I'm going to two finger tap on this because I'm a, I have Mac. I'm going to save the image as BBQ. First try. I'm going to save it to my desktop. And there you see it. Right? So then I'm going to go over here and I'm going to insert it. Here's my BBQ slide. And because this is kind of like smoky looking, I'm going to go ahead and, and see if, the, if I can kind of keep that smoky looking vibe. Let's see. Oops. Double click here. Upload and. Okay, well, it's not awful, but we're not looking for not awful. We're looking for amazing because that's just the way that we operate, right? So, yeah, I could center it up and maybe look like a frame. It's fine. Let's see if we can do better. So, I'm going to go ahead and delete this. I'm going to do better by going back over here, right? Here's my barbecue, here's my images. I haven't done this yet, so let me do that. Search tools. Click on it. And it says color. Um, I think this is a little odd because it's really the color of the back, transparent. And you may think it's under something else like type. But it is not under type. It's under color. So think of that as the color is clear, transparent. Now, because we have a different qualifier, we've got some different items. Let's click on this one. Oh, there's the international symbol for ch that checkerboard symbol for transparency, right? So this shows me how big it is, but none of this is going to show up. So again, I'm going to two finger click, save image as. We're going to call this one second try. over here there it is you see it I'm gonna to go to barbecue slide insert image and we're gonna call this one second try Wow okay right looks pretty good now because um, I got a Mac I can just move this over here and just put them side by side This one's smaller. Looks neat, right? Again, this one's not terrible, but I think this one's better. And if you don't like this transparency, let's see what else we got over here. Oh, look here. Okay, look here. This is our old friend. We put this one on. You know what? This shows you that it's not a transparency. So this one, you just have to double check. Look at this. 
See, that one is. That one's pretty awesome. But that's how you're going to do it. Um, and when we go back over here, we can just take this guy, delete it, center it up. Nice. And we're good to go. All right. Thanks to Jessica Powell, also known as iTech Jess on Twitter. And her um, website is iTech Jess, too. That's Jess as in short for Jessica. I-T-E-C-H-J-E-S-S dot -E -S com. Thanks, Jess, for the um, for showing me that. And um, I hope you guys learned a little. Now, the great thing about this course is that you can, well, maybe it's the worst thing, too, is you have the ability to listen to this over and over again. Um, thanks a lot, and we'll see you soon.